Hello there, and welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 2. That's right, it's adventure time in the Fallout universe. Last time on Fallout 2, we were at the Vault 15 squatters, trying to figure something out for Tandy. Let's see what's going on, eh? Hi, I'm Rebecca. Can we talk privately, please? Hmm. Sure. Why need the privacy? Whispering. You may think I'm crazy, but I get the feeling I'm being watched all the time. It's rather disturbing, and I'm a bit on edge because of it. All right, uh, where can we go to talk? Thanks. We can go to my tent. All right. We should be able to talk here. All right, I have some questions for you first. Well, what do you want to know? What's going on around here? We call this place the Squat because it was settled by the homeless of many of many cities. It's not much, but it's all we have. To the west is a city called the NCR. They've known about us for quite some time and never offered us any kind of help or hindrance. Now, they are suddenly claiming this area as their ancestral home, and they want it back. They keep sending people here to try and talk us out of our home, but they won't understand that we have nowhere else to go. We don't have the skills necessary to survive on our own if we leave here. What is it here that they want so badly? Well, there is a vault here. I think it's number 15. They want to loot it for any old technology that may still be there. Hmm. That explains a lot. You've been very helpful. I need to ask some more questions, though. I'm a, who's in charge around here? That would be Zeke. He runs everything up here. You can find him in the building over there. Points to the northeast. Thank you. I need to ask some more questions. I'm looking for Vault 13. Do you know anything about it? I'm sorry. I have no idea. I would have asked about it in NCR. They've taken a great interest in vaults lately. Ah, all right. I will. Tell me about the vault. Well, we're not supposed to talk about it, but since I need your help, the vault is being repaired by Darian. He's our benefactor. When it's fully functional, we're all supposed to move in. Or we'll be safe from raiders, slavers, and such. So far, he has the food and water systems up, but that's about it. You know, it's kind of funny that they're managed to get something that complex fixed, but they're but not the lights. The damn place is lit by torches. Anyway, Darian doesn't want anyone to know what's going on with that vault. He's afraid that someone will take it all away from us if they find out. So we're supposed to drive off anyone who shows up here, especially the NCR. Hmm, I need to know more. So tell me about Darian. There's not much to say, really. Darian keeps to himself and never leaves the vault. If he has anything to say, he says it through Zeke. I've only met him once, and he seemed like a nice guy. Hmm. Nice guys. Finish Latin. Okay. That's okay. You are very helpful. What do you want to know? Thanks, Rebecca. Let's talk about your problem now. I have a daughter named Chrissy who's a bit of a tomboy. She likes to run around, explore, and pretty much stick her nose into things. Chrissy's a good kid, though. She doesn't cause trouble. She's always home on time, and she's shown herself to be a very responsible young lady. I let her do as she pleases most of the time. Last week, Chrissy didn't come home. I've asked around, and nobody's seen or heard of her. I try to find her myself, but Zeke, he's... He's sort of the mayor here. Stop me. He said it wasn't safe for me to go out looking on my own. He'd have some of his men do it. They couldn't find her either, and that said maybe that the slavers got her. I can't explain why, but I don't believe the slavers took her. I have an uneasy feeling that something else is going on, and then there's this feeling that I'm being followed. I've had it ever since I talked to Zeke about Chrissy. I need someone to help me find my daughter. Will you please help me? Hmm. All right, Rebecca. I'll try to help you. Thank you so much. I've never been able to repay you for this. I'll wait here until you bring... Hey, there was someone outside listening to us. I saw their shadow at the tent wall. They just ran out that way, points to the northeast. They must have heard everything. Hmm. They won't stop me from finding your daughter. <laughs> to the northeast, eh? Hi, I'm Dahlia. What can I help you with? Did you see someone go by here in a hurry? I see people go by here every day. I really don't pay much attention to them. <sighs> Look, a young girl's life is at stake here, the daughter of a worried mother. Can you please help me out? 
I don't have a rad rat's ass. I don't give a rad rat's ass. I'm sorry. I'm just a gun who's hired to stand here and guard this trail. Other than that, I don't know what's going on around here. I had a daughter once, though, and yeah, some guy went by here. I let him through because he knew the proper sign. Just like the sign you gave me. Go on, I'm out of here. What? Thanks. I won't forget this, Dahlia. The proper sign? I gave her a sign? Hmm. Interesting. Well, time to save the game. Just in case. Let's, well, let's go find out who that was. Oh, where, oh, where could this person be? I should shoot you dead, but I'm kind of curious about what you could possibly have to say to me. Hmm. I'm looking for a missing girl. Seen her? You mean the one locked up and back that we've been having fun with? No, I haven't seen her. Oh my god. <sighs> You're one sick puppy. Hand over the girl, and we can all leave here alive. Why in hell should I do that? Hmm. Hey, let's try this. I doubt he's going to do that. Because if we fight, one of us will die. Ah, uh, no, you know what? Okay, let's try this one. Ha! Ugh. Yeah, I... Yeah, okay. Here's the key to her cell. She's in the back room of the shack. Take her and get out, but don't come back. If I see you again, we'll see who lives and who dies. Thanks. You did the right thing. Awesome possum. We did it. We did it. We did it. We got the girl out alive without having to blow apart some people. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. I hope she's okay. If you're here to try and rape me, you're going to be wearing your balls as a bow tie, get it? Okay, I guess she's okay for now. Thank goodness. Bow tie? Yeah, a fancy piece of cloth worn around the neck for decoration. It's like a scarf, but for men. Now just imagine me kicking you so hard that you end up wearing your dangly about your neck, get it? I get the picture. Please don't hurt me. Okay, so why are you here? I'd like to know who you are and what is going on here. In a nutshell, my name is Chrissy, and I'm from the squat. I was exploring last week when I found that entrance out there. I thought it might be an abandoned mine or something, so I decided to check it out. Well, it's not a mine. It's a secret entrance into Vault 15. The vault is being used as a base for a band of raiders called the Khans. They caught me snooping around, and their leader, Darian, had me locked up in here. The people of the squad are protecting these guys by helping them keep the vault a secret, but they don't know what's really going on here. Darian told us that the vault was being repaired so we could have a safe place to live with lots of food and water, but it's all a lie. I've been in there and looked around. The vault is dead, and the food and water machines don't work. Our food and water's been coming from the spoils raiders against caravans. Oh, man. Look, I've got to go home and warn everyone about what's really going on here. We can't help these monsters. Will you take me home? All right, I'll take you home. Really? Awesome, let's go! Alright. And she runs like an idiot. Whatever. Mr. Key, you have served me well. I'm just equipping my shotgun, just in case. Alright. Let's talk to her now. You saved my daughter. I can never repay you for your kindness. Thank you. Please wait here. I need to talk to Chrissy, and then I'd like to talk to you. All right. My daughter has told me everything. I find it hard to believe that Darian is such a monster after all he's been doing for us. And I think we've been helping him hide his operations as a raider. I can guarantee you, guarantee you, you... We won't stand for it any longer. I've already talked to Zeke, and he wants to see you. You should go see him now. Thank you. Bam! Level up!
That was a lot of experience points. Awesome. Awesome possum. Why do I keep saying that? Let's level up, shall we? Do 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 do. Oh, I was hoping for a for a perk. Oh well. <laughs> Let's see. Mm -hmm. Barter. Hey, barter's pretty high. Uh, pair traps. I don't know what I want to put my points into. I guess some more small guns. Yeah, 125 is good. Guess some lock picking. Okay. Some speech would be all right, and the rest will go into bartering, I suppose. Well, let's take one, two, three, four, five. All right, barter's at 55%, that's good. Repair's at 60. And eh, let's keep that 58 for now. Anything else? Sneak, no, doctor, no. First aid, here we go. Let's raise that to 70. Melee weapons, unarmed, uh, let's... Let's do energy weapons. I know I'm gonna have an energy weapon eventually. Put it at four. Okay. Well, actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, let's not waste it yet. Let's put them in here. Wait, do they count three? No, that's two there. Two, two, two. I guess they start counting three there. Hmm. Okay, well, I'll just put some more into first aid. First aid's important, you know. There we go. Alright, I do believe this is Zeke here, an older squatter. Yeah, let's talk to him. Rebecca has told me what you did for her. I want you, I want to apologize for the treatment you received here. You certainly didn't deserve it. What can I help you with? Now you see, I sort of skipped all of that. If you try to talk to people around here, they'll be quite rude to you, especially him. So, you know, they're just rude because they were trying to protect the other people. Um, who were protecting the cons, so. Alright, I've got some questions for you. What do you want to know? Do you work for Darien? Yes, I do. I act as a middleman between him and the people up here. I'm not very happy about the fact now that I know what he's up to. I see. What do you want to know? What do you intend to do about the raiders? Nothing. They have the guns, they control the water, and they control the food. That means they're in charge. Period. We have no skills, no means of support without the back Nandarian. How can we turn against him? We're at his mercy. Would you consider making a deal with the NCR? That all depends. What did you have in mind? Join NCR. Let them annex your territory and give them access to the vault. In return, they can teach you all the skills you need to survive on your own and offer you their protection. Not bad. I like it. You got yourself a deal if you can get NCR to agree to it as well. But... Look, someone has to take care of Darien and his cronies. It should be done now, before they realize what has happened and have time to prepare for an attack. Why not get this over with and take Darien out now? You'll have the element of surprise on your side. Yeah, I guess it has to be done. Excellent. Good luck to you, and thank you. Okay. What do you want to know? Where's the vault's entrance? It's behind that door over there, but it's locked from the other side. Trap, too. I don't have any means opening it, but wait a minute. Uh, I found this key card some time ago and I have no idea what it's for. Rebecca says that you found some sort of door where they were holding Chrissy. Maybe this card will open it. Here, take it. Thanks, I'll give it a try. What do you want to know? Is there anything else going on around here? Just the problems with the NCR. But I think the deal you offer will solve that. Okay. I guess that's it. I'll be going now. Thank you. 
A new mission has dawned upon us. And you know what? I don't think I'm even ready for it. I still have this crappy ass armor. Uh, let's see. A scoped hunting rifle. Damage 8 to 20. Uh, that's pretty good. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Alright, but I do believe we have a Vault 15 keycard. Let's make sure everyone is healed up. Rest until party. Rest until healed. Yeah, there we go. Alright, yeah. HP's at 53. God, my health sucks. What is my, um, it's endurance. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no wonder I, I suck. I mean, my endurance is terrible. Why did I put it so low? <laughs> I'm so screwed. All right, let's do it, though. Let's, let's do this. In fact, I'm going to save the game. And here we go. I, I said here we go. There we go. All right. If he sees me again, he'll shoot me. Phil, a con guard. Well, Mr. Phil, I do believe that my grease gun has a range of 20. Let us see how well that is for you. Can I end combat? Okay, good. Let's go right here. Alright. He's in range. Can I reload? Heck yeah. I've got lots of... What, what do you take? 45 caliber? Oh, crap. I only have a few of those. Well. I think I'll change to my hunting rifle for now. Cause I believe I've got a lot of that. I, I think. No, I don't. Whatever. Ninety-five percent's good enough for me. And next time the fight begins. See you then.